this question we're going to be doing some subtraction of functions and division of func functions we're not going to plug anything other than x in which may seem a little strange so i'm going to do part b so it's f minus g of x and the way you do this is f of x minus g of x and there's really nothing to do here because you're plugging in x, so f of x is just x squared minus 3x. Now g is x plus 1, so it's minus x plus 1, but it's minus the whole quantity x plus 1. If you want, you could wrap uh, f of x in parentheses just so you can see where it came from. So we have x squared minus 3x minus x minus 1. We can combine those middle terms. Minus 3x minus x is minus 4x minus 1. And that should be under here. All right. Part D, f over g of x, is just f of x over g of x. And now, actually, I'm happy that I put these in parentheses because it's really easy for me to see what is each term, what's f and what's g. So f is x squared minus 3x. g is x plus 1. Uh, you could factor an x out of the numerator, but it's not going to cancel anything in the denominator. So I think I'm going to leave it just like this. I'll check that. And that is exactly what we got. And the other parts can be the same, you just multiply and add.